What? And this is the mom's boyfriend doing this to her? We got that recipe, man. RJ tapping in with another little reaction. Now look, we got something a little different. Something a little crazy once again, because y'all always send me some crazy ass video to react to. But basically, let me show y'all this right here. Mom comes home and catches her 17-year-old daughter with her man and their friends. And their friends? Bro, what is going on? 17, I don't know what's going on now. Can someone tell me what's going on? If y'all watched the last video, baby father gets caught with a 6-year-old babysitter. Look, we'll get to this reaction real quick. Keep sending me some more reactions, some more videos to react to. Because, hey, I messed, with, I messed with doing the reactions because y'all obviously like me giving my opinion on things. You know what I'm saying? I like to have a voice. I'm going to use my platform for that. So, we're going to get right into this and we're going to see what's going on here. It's got 700,000 views on World Star. I can bomb a clout out of order. So, they're Jamaican. Mm -hmm. I just want come out of shelter for... You're fucking bright and out of order. Now, if you speak Jamaican, please let me know what she just said. I know a bomb buckler. I don't. I know what that means. I know what that means. I know what that means. Ma'am, you don't come back in here either. Oh, really? Hey, hey. I'm warning you. Don't come back here, Robert. That's how you gonna do it, itch. So that's her. That's okay. This is the daughter, obviously. And then this is. This her boyfriend. Her was her boyfriend. That's how you gonna it, do it, itch? After, after I come out the shelter? Come out the shower? Did you say come out the shower? Don't say she was in the shower and it, and that quick? Damn. And pay thousands of dollars to put a roof over your friggin' head, you and your sisters? This is how you show me respect? That is tough. This that is AI go, that's tough, though. That is tough. And she's old enough to know that's wrong, too. You know what I'm saying? How you show me? But see, this is, you know what? Normally, a girl wouldn't be like, hold on, I got to talk some shit real quick. <laughs> Basically, normally, like, a girl, 17-year-old girl, wouldn't normally act like this, be like this. So that means they got an influence from somebody else on the internet, maybe older, that they look at. It's because of the internet. We're being honest. It's because of the internet. Ain't no way no 70 year old is just thinking about that. It's the it's the internet. Maybe some she's seen. Maybe some girl says she like older men or she like messing with my mom's boyfriend when she's not home. Literally, it could be that. So she decided to try it herself and got caught. To be honest. Respect. After all that I do for my family, you ungrateful bitch. I just don't oh, need the cops shit. to come here right now. Oh, shit. Yeah, I'm grateful. And honestly, I'm going to be honest. I don't even blame the mother for calling her, her daughter up. You know what I'm saying? I really don't blame her. I really don't blame her. That's tough. You feel me? Uh, uh, after I tell her. Well, why are you here? Uh, what the after, fuck you got to do Listen. Don't let the cops stop. Robert, go to. Oh. What? And this is the mom's boyfriend doing this to her? Or is that like, like the, is this, is this, hold on, hold on, hold on, my bad, my bad. Or is this the, wait, hold on, I'm so confused. So is this right here the boyfriend or like the husband? Ain't no way, he looked too young, ain't no way, that's gotta be, that has definitely gotta be the boy, like the boyfriend, right? What what is going on here, bruh? Through the door. Go through the door. God says. I don't care. Go. I, I, yeah, let her walk and get some fresh air in your brains, cause guess what? In an hour, uh, blood clot use Mari. The motor suffer when we suffer in our life, and I don't want to turn my Damn. house into a whorehouse. Now I'm about to go lie. 
I don't know what she is saying right now, but I look, just know she's saying you're not coming. I don't know. Actually, I don't know. Someone translate it for me, please. Eh? Who are else? I'm telling you, suffer with them at Pitney, huh? Hmm? Fucking right on all to order. She out here? She out Damn, here that's a nice ass. Hold on, that's a nice ass. That's a nice ass house, though. She just walked up like six, seven, eight more steps, too. Oh, God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let you bring the cops in here and see what happened. Uh, oh, no, that house is like nice as hell. Look, look, and it goes upstairs even more. What the hell? This big ass house. After I'm in there now, now it's one o'clock in the night. I come out here. I see the guy. Why the fuck you gonna bring a guy into my life? After you see all what? that I've been through telling me our people don't have nowhere where to sleep. Damn, her, she hurt. Her mother feeling it. She, she really hurt right now. You can tell by the way she's just talking and no one even around. She's talking for real. I feel sorry for the mother, man. No cap. And, and, and because you know my weakness for people, you gonna tell them what to say so that Amari can be sorry for them. Huh? Your, your cute way of disrespecting my house. I, I say to the guy, I, I come out. Now, I'm the adult in the house, and I've gone down to shit. Yeah. I come out here, I see her and the guy. Oh, you said it was going oh so, they, so they, they got caught. Wait, so... I'm confused, because the title of this, the title of this is Mom Kosoma Catches Her 7-Year-Old Daughter With her man and their friend. Maybe there's more that's gonna happen. I don't know. Let's see. And I say, Destiny, go to your room. Yeah, I haven't even said that. When I tell her go to her room, I come in the kitchen. Look at my kitchen. So all these people in my house eat one plate, one pot of food, rice, everything. Damn, are they scandalous? She had all her friends over there. Okay, so they. Okay, it's a nice ass house, a nice ass area. You know what I'm saying? They using that using her daughter to chill, do whatever, as you can tell. Look how they left the house. Look. King, Look at this. Run all day eating out my, 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 my food for the coronavirus. Eating up all the food during the little, you know what I'm saying, what was going on situation. Eating up all day food, chilling over there. That's tough. Hard-working mother, you know what I'm saying? And come home to this? And, 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 and look at my friggin' place. And young, your, your so-called 17-year-old, I want to bring money in on my face. I, I, I say to the guy, I say, Destiny, go upstairs. He didn't say nothing bad. So they figure I'm going back to my room and I ain't coming back out. She come back out here with the guy. Damn. She come back out here with the guy. So I tell him, he got to go. She telling the guy, he ain't got to go nowhere. Oh, so she talking back like that. He ain't got to go nowhere. This is not your, oh, uh, so she getting slick. She in that phase, though. She in that phase where she rebellious. She doesn't say going to get anything they parents say. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I heard what you said. Huh? After me work so hard in her life. Huh? After me got you so much, after God saved me, saved my family, she telling the dude he ain't got to go nowhere. She ain't know that God. Like, like she in control of the house. That's, that's crazy. I ain't going to lie, you know what I'm saying? Some, some teens be getting out of, out of pocket sometimes. You know what I'm saying? Talk and I understand. To me and God tell me things. There's a no without them. They wouldn't even, without their parents, they wouldn't even be here. God say, Mona, you've been set up. They work on your weakness. Work on your weakness. You want to live in with your man in my house. So you come to me with your little story. Oh, this poor guy. Oh, okay. So it's the, it's the girls, the girlfriend's men and their friends. See, I'm thinking, I thought whole time it was like, the mom's man and the mom's man's friends. You know what I'm saying? But it was actually, okay, okay, okay. But still, this is messed up, though. 
the fact that, hold on, then we can go back to when he put his hands on her mouth like that. What? What is that? He don't know where his mother at. They were staying in an hotel. And, and then gave up, gave up this sop story to her mom saying that he needs a place to stay, all this. I'd be, if I was him, I'd be embarrassed to even stay there. Like, you know what I'm saying? So she's bringing over his friends. They eating up all the food, leaving the kitchen dirty. In that nice ass house, bro. This is, that's chat. That's actually sad, bro. How could you do your mom like that? I can't get her on the phone. Oh, really? Really? And all your bullshit story? Because you know I'm a child of God and I've been through a lot. See, so you see that, that's just, this is where it's messed up. So as you can see, the mother, child of God, she believes. You know what I'm saying? So she, she knows that when someone comes to her and asks for help or something like that, she gonna give the help. And they gonna come back and do this to her. Come back and do all this to her. The house should be fully clean. She shouldn't even have to come home to nothing even in the sink. They left the pots and pans, left half of chicken, like half a little chicken in there. I don't know what. That's sad. That's sad, man. That's sad. I want to work on my weakness. Satan, you lie. And, and, and at first, they had me. They got me. I was like, I, I say to the guy, hey, don't worry, son. Whatever you've been through, my whole family have been through. Damn. This is this is getting worse and worse. He's telling the guy that just had that, his hands around her daughter saying, it's all right, we all been through it. Stay here with us. She's taking him in as her own, but it's still her daughter's boyfriend. And she's still like bringing him in. That's love. And they going to do this to her? A mother for you. And then when I lay down and God turn up my, my tuner, in my brain, God said to me, Amari, they set you up. Set you up to come live in my house with a man at 17 years old. Damn. So they, so they, they, they made a little game plan. Just live with me. That boy was living there, eating free, taking good showers, all that for the free. My bad, I keep pausing it. All right, I'm uh, done pausing. I'm done pausing. It. Imagine. So God, you take me, not even out of shelter. You took me off the streets, and I must do what? Come live what? Dirty life, dirty life, Father God. Oh, right here, right here. Huh? Oh, the first so many people gonna be in my house, and and I go look, to look my at, look bed all, look with dirty food. dishes. Look at all the food on the on the, well, on when the I'm stove. When I'm on my my phone ordering things by Amazon. Thousands of stuff going to Walmart, buy thousands of stuff going to BJ, buy thousands of stuff. You don't just bring Robert, you bring all his friends. What they order it on Amazon, food, all that? Eat up all the stuff. That's that's yeah. that was even even the main thing, but this shouldn't. I tell you, Jonathan. It shouldn't be. No, you're right. Jonathan, the last couple of weeks, ask Sharni, how much thousand have I spent just Thousands. to prepare for this virus thing? And I tell you, the little girl, little girl, 17 year old, hug up with man one o'clock at night, undercover, under sheet, and I'm her mother. And all I say, what? Jonathan. All I say, I say, destiny go upstairs. That is tragic. I didn't even say leave him on the couch. I said, destiny go. Damn. Damn, damn. That's that is tragic. That is tragic. I'm not gonna lie. It's actually pretty sad though. If you think about it, she's spending thousands on him. All types of let him in the house. Made a little sorry, made up story. He could live there. Kitchen like that, that's messed up. And then she said, I don't even want no cops coming. So look, you know she really a child of God. She really believes because someone really would have turned up, probably started punching, kicking, who knows? You know what I'm saying? Who, what, what, what would have happened? You know what I'm saying? Let's be honest. 
her, though, she was just trying to see what really happened. Why would it happen to her? Because she was in that same situation. And she's trying to bring somebody in, man. See, watch who you, watch who you know, man. Watch who you know. Always. They always might want to hang out with you, chill with you. Not just because they're trying to really just hang out and chill with you. They're trying to get closer to you. Just trying to pick you apart. You know what I'm saying? See what you're really on to. See what you're really doing. Because if someone really actually cared, think about it. Wouldn't they, like, text you every day or something like that? Hit you up every day? Call you every day? If they can go five days without talking to you, they can go their whole life without talking to you. I guarantee you that, man. 